Hey, what's up, Angel? All right, so we've got Rain out here, just doing some, we're transferring to off-leash outside. She's doing really well with it. Um, so we're just kind of in the neighborhood around, around my house. Got cars driving by. Rain, hill. Um, she's responding really well. So, so right now, she's just kind of a, a champion at the, the off-leash healing. So not that she's, she's perfect and she still has two weeks here. So she's just kind of, kind of basically, uh, frankly, she's a little bit ahead on her off-leash healing. On her downing, she's a little behind, so she's not downing quite as well as I'd like. Um, but that's, it is what it is. We'll just, we let the dogs go at their own pace. Um, this, I'll tell you though, if you can get a good focused walk in, with these dogs and you can do it off leash everything else is everything else is gravy so, so this is the first thing we worry about with the dogs once the dog gets to this point then they just come along really nicely so super happy with her super proud of her i know you're missing her um but yeah everything's everything's going well so far so hopefully you don't miss her too much Feel? Good. Good girl. Rain. Down. Good job, sweetie. Oh, that was a great down. Um, yeah, she did really well there. Still holding that down. It's still hot enough outside that we want to do downs in the shade just so they're uh, just so they're comfortable while you're doing it. So we've got a dog also in training over here named Oakley. Oakley's training to be a service dog. Rain's over there dreaming about chasing something. You can tell. Because that's her style. So we'll go pick her up. Now we'll release her. So typically the hardest time for a dog to stay in a down is as we're walking up to it. So that's, dogs naturally want to break right there. And so if they do, um, we just, we just go away from them. Okay, sweetie. Good girl, good girl. And that's when they get their big affection when they come in after that. Yeah, good job.